Coach Crabtree. Uh, we are at the Taj Mahal of youth facilities in the United States of America, um, Cedar Point Sports Center. How far is your house from this place? Five minutes. This Five minutes away. It's unbelievable what they've done with this indoor complex. Can hold uh, multi events at the same time. Currently, we got wrestling going on. We also have a basketball tournament going on right beside the wrestling. So it's unbelievable. It's awesome. There's a walking track upstairs. Uh, right now, we're in the uh, center court, the finals court where they have the championships for their basketballs at. So it's a, it's a pretty awesome place. You know, something like this, I was talking to Wes upstairs. Wes runs the facility. Uh, they do partnerships with local high schools, right? You can have a dual meet in this gym if you want to. Yes, yeah, we have, um, you can do dual meets. I know last year St. Mary's did. We actually have it set up with our youth program where our basketball team um, program comes out here and uh, for like three or four hours where all the youth programs can uh, practice at the same time. Our high school basketball programs can come out here and practice at the same time. So like we had a uh, wrestling event on Wednesday, so basketball was kicked out of the gym after school, so they came out here and practiced, which usually they'd have to practice after school, then I'd have to quickly set up. So these guys are uh, working with us. Uh, we can been approached about hosting a duel out here, but we're waiting to see kind of what happens with this uh, pandemic and everything. Probably in the future, we'll do something out here, which is uh, awesome. But, um, you know, we're glad that we have, um, you know, the sports center and uh, Cedar Point to help out all the local schools. You know, you look next door, it's, it's sports force. You can, your kid can wrestle, or not wrestle, but play a baseball national caliber uh, event every week. Yeah, uh, our uh, travel team, the Snusky Bay Scrappers, has played out here uh, for the past, since the place opened four years ago. We play all of our tournaments out here. So we play teams from all across the country, Florida, um, California teams have come. Um, you know, all through the Midwest, uh, when there's a normal summer going on, we play a national schedule. You know, we Ten barely minutes, play, five minutes from home. Yeah, we barely play That's any um, Ohio teams. That's wild. So our theory is, why not go to Sports Force and have the teams come to us instead of us traveling to them? Sports Force and Sandusky or Cedar Point Sports Center are two completely different things that sit directly next to one another. Yeah, different it's partnerships. Amazing. Different partnerships with different people, but. When the people who partner with Cedar Point with the Sports Center saw how well the Sports Force was going on, they said, hey, why not? So No brainer for Cedar Point. Oh, absolutely. And Cedar Point, listen, man, I was rolling up to the Death Star. I, I had to do the wide-angle lens to get this place into it, and then I had to back up because this this is an ominous building. It's Death Star. Come on, Zebra. I couldn't using believe way, it. You're using bigger words than I know what they're saying, but Death Star, absolutely. No, okay? It's amazing. Anonymous, I don't know, but huge, gigantic, it's awesome. So, yeah, if you guys, if you haven't been here, you need to figure out how to get here because it's pretty awesome. The Sports Center and Sports Force Baseball and Softball Park. Love it. All right, could the Pirates have a duel in here anytime soon, you think? I think in the foreseeable future, yes. Uh, but, you know, I hopefully we have a duel next week. With this pandemic going on. Who you guys got? Uh, Wednesday we wrestle Sandusky and Ashland, and then we go to the Finley Duels on Saturday. I hope that happens, man. No kidding, man. As, as I keep saying to Jared, logistical nightmare, fluid situation. <laughs> That's what it all is. Yeah, you know, it's a, uh, it's a quiet storm coming, but, you know, us wrestling people, we just keep chugging away at it. All right, million-dollar question. You ready? Yep. I know you love it. All Are right. you a barman? Or are you a, I gotta get this in the view, or are you a body wash man? Which one are you trying to scratch? Bar man. All right, man. there we love go, we the got bar. a bar man. The fence soap, I don't leave home without it. I, you don't, I know you love it. Did yeah. you see that the, the owner? Yeah. The, the the man who, the proprietor of it? Yep. Gus Seiko, or Guy yep. Seiko is here. Yep, I already talked to him this morning because we ordered some for the wrestling program earlier this it. year. I love so. it, that's how this should work. One oh, yeah. hand washes the other, no pun intended. That's right, man, we all gotta stick together. Especially right. during these times. All right. Thank you for the time. Good luck. Go Pirates. That's right. I love watching the Pirates. But we got to do – we'll do a quick after here. Yep. We'll do absolutely. a quick after here. We'll, we'll talk real quick. Good luck to you guys. Thanks, Zeb.